What's up everyone, welcome to my channel. In this video, I'm going to give you a quick overview of the InVision platform and its different features. InVision is a great free platform, free to use platform, that you can use to create designs. So you can like freehand and create designs and boards and charts and everything. So it is pretty easy to use and has lots of powerful features as well as integrations with lots of popular sites and surfaces. So let's go right to it. First, you'll need to go to their website, that's envisionapp.com, and you will land on this page right here. Here, uh, they say freehand, the all-in-one collaborative workspace. And you, uh, they say it's collaborative because you can add your team members and share your work with them and allow them to edit it and view it. So here, if you scroll down, you can see some uh, description, some uh, reviews on uh, the platform, as well as uh, they tell you to try it, it is free, so it is free to use. And you can explore freehand, prototype, company, and resources. So let's view freehand really quickly. Okay, so you can use it to explore, to plan here in like a board view such as Trello. You can add team members, as you can see here. This like animation explains it, as well as some other features. And uh, you can use freehand AI, so that's pretty cool so that they integrated artificial intelligence into their uh, workflow. And uh, here you can view team building, brainstorm, you can use it to like uh, um, organize your ideas and add timer and so on to uh, brainstorm, ideating to ideate, presentation and reviewing. So uh, here in the, the freehand for the prototype here, and here they say you can create powerful prototypes in minutes so that if you are working in like UX design, you can create your prototypes right in here in the Envision app. And now that we saw like an overview of some of the features, let's go ahead and sign up. They say it's free or you can sign in if you already have an account. So for us, let's sign up here and you can enter some basic information like your work email, your name, your role and your password. So. I'll go ahead and like copy a temporary email and this email is like a temporary email just for the sake of this video tutorial. However, if you are creating this account for yourself or your team member, you should of course enter your main email. So I'll enter my name. My role is um, like uh, an educator. So and the password here, I'll enter it. So I'll enter my details and click on sign up and then get back to you. Okay, now they sent me a verification email with uh, like a verification code, I'll have to enter it. So I'll open the temp mail uh, page here. They set up a, uh, an inbox for me so I can view the messages here. Okay, so let's copy this code. Of course, this step is uh, like not necessary at all. However, I'm just creating, I have already a main account. I'm just creating this account from scratch just to show you how. So um, here you can skip this step and then you will be redirected directly to your main dashboard or your main account page. Okay, so um, they ask you if you are using a trackpad or a mouse, that's pretty cool. Now I'm on my PC, so I'm using a mouse right now. Okay, to start, hold control and scroll, mouse to zoom, okay. So they give you like a mini tutorial, I got it. Okay, hold space, Click and drag to move around. Okay, got it again. Got it. So here they let you in directly to the designing uh, page. That's uh, the page where you'll land if you want to design, create a new design. However, this one contains like uh, some features here. Okay. So um, let's uh, go back here to our main documents or our main dashboard. Here are the recent documents. Uh, sorry, the smart template. The recent documents is this one, the untitled one, like the preview of the features. Here I have my home, my documents, my spaces, the people or my teammates, uh, the apps or integrations and more. So let's view uh, the apps really quickly. So you can integrate with, uh, or you can use lots of uh, tools and integrate them with uh, Envision. So here is the AI that I told you about. You can configure it. However, we will not do this in this video. You can integrate it with uh, Trello, Slack, Zoom, Google, Jira, as well as some others really, uh, some other really popular uh, tools. So um, here in the spaces, 
you can go ahead and create a new space to organize your documents. So let's go ahead and uh, create a new document. You can create a new document using a template. So here are some templates like brainstorm, sprint planner, or wireframing uh, weekly team uh, meeting. So you can click on any uh, template here to start editing it. Okay. Here you can select a name or an, an, an icon for your um, design. So let's choose this book icon and let's name it like test design. Okay. And here is the design. So um, you had to click on control and then scroll to uh, zoom in and out. And here they give you like a board view, like an icon here, here and um, some basic elements. So here you can edit any element. Here is the time uh, keeper. So the maximum length and uh, minutes here. And you can add the timer here to start uh, counting. So start working like brainstorming if you want to add like a pause after certain types of a certain time or certain uh, minutes you can add. So, so let's pause it. You can here, uh, you have a board view similar to uh, Trello here, um, space and then drag, okay. Now, here are the boards, here the different cards, you can add titles, so here you, uh, the titles for the boards themselves, highlights and updates, discussions and topics, so you can edit any uh, text here, so let's name this one in progress, okay, and you can add titles, so this is a task, like task one, okay, and you can of course uh, assign members, add this change the status, add a due date, add property, and so on. And you can uh, click after you edit it. You can, of course, uh, change the status. So to do in progress, done, won't do, blocked. And um, here you can drag, of course, the card uh, to another uh, list here. And you can, if in the tab here on the at the bottom, you can add sticky notes, text. Uh, shapes, add like uh, color or like free free draw, add a table or layouts here, you can add layouts, add board, grid, table, timeline, pages, and here you can upload images or embed them or uh, uh, like media, add comments, add reactions, and here you can explore, you can uh, like add uh, people or cards, so let's uh, view the cards for example, they can click here to add a card. And you can click here to add a counter if you want to. So um, you can also edit uh, each element here on this page to make it your own. So now we are in the main page again. Let me show you how to create a new blank document. So create new. You can uh, click on blank freehand or you can explore intelligent canvas, brainstorm like types of uh, projects. So let's start with a blank one. And here you can add elements as you wish. So I can add text here. So this is a title. Okay. I can edit the text uh, color, the uh, make it bold, italic, or highlighted. Uh, add the alignment, edit the alignments, add links, and so on. Uh, also the text size. I can add shapes. So let me add this shape right here. Okay can also align it and change the color so let's make it red and let's make the text um, greenish let's not highlight it okay you can here explore you can add um, objects so cards flip cards poll and uh, many others and here you can add integrations as well so actions like spinner stamp buzzer and um, add integrations like figma adobe xd and google docs and many many more so uh, here you have kits and you have templates so you can uh, browse the templates directly from the new projects page so that was like a quick overview of the InVision uh, platform and its different features